don't let the age of my next guest this morning fool you. Now, she may only be 11 years old, but you put a paintbrush in her hands, and she is a force to be reckoned with. Chloe Barton has been down here in Key West visiting under a number of local artists. You'll be seeing some of her paintings this morning, and trust me, you won't forget these paintings once you see them. Chloe, thank you so much for being here with me today. All right, Chloe, tell our viewers how your trip to Key West has been so far. It's been really fun, and I've seen lots of sites that I haven't seen before back where I live. Mm -hmm. And you've done a lot of painting, right? Yes, uh, quite a few. <laughs> okay, tell, tell me about one of your paintings that you've done since you've been in Key West. What did you paint? One of my paintings is a picture of a studio, Kate Studio. Mm -hmm. I made it um, where it's brighter and better looking. Okay. But I put in some of the stuff that was originally from her studio. Okay, so you did the inside of the studio or the outside of her studio? I did it from the outside view. You did it from the outside view. Now, Chloe, you are so good at painting. I've been able to see some of your paintings, and I love them. I'm so impressed. I don't know how you know how to paint that way. When did you begin painting? I began painting when I was around two years old. Two years old. So how, you're two years old. You're very little at two years of age. So how did you pick up a paintbrush, Chloe? I would find stuff laying around the house mm -hmm. and I just try to paint with it because I saw other people doing it and mm -hmm. I'm a copycat so I got a copy. <laughs> <laughs> so you just started doing it at two and Chloe, tell, tell us about some of the things that you like to paint. I like to paint animals, fantasy, landscapes, almost everything. Okay, do you do people yet? I'm not really good at people. I just can't get the hands, faces, and stuff right. They're hard. Yes. I used to do portraits. Those were way too hard. And I'm mostly inspired by animals and stuff like nature. Mm -hmm. yeah. So you like being outdoors? and Yes, I like spending my time around outside. What do your friends think of all of, all of your paintings that you do, Chloe? They think I'm really great. They like to encourage me to do more. They watch me when I do some art, and they ask me if I could do some for them. Now, do you have some artists who inspire you, Chloe? Kate Peachy and Van Gogh. Okay, and now you mentioned Kate Peachy, who is someone that you've been working with since you were just a little girl picking up that paintbrush, right? Yes. <laughs> and Kate has a studio down here in Key West on White Street, and I know that some of your pieces were on display. What was it like seeing your, your work in her studio? It was very cool. I felt pretty proud, and I just walk around, and I'm like, I did that? <laughs> it's kind of hard to believe, huh? Yes. Yeah, <laughs> now, how long does it take you to do a painting? Actually, it takes me only like a day. I'm pretty quick. Well, it really mm -hmm. depends like how big the piece is and how much effort and time I put into it. Okay. So do you pick up a paintbrush every day, Chloe? Yes, I pretty much do. You do every day? Yes. So you're disciplined then? Yes. But you would say that, that you enjoy it, though. It's not like something you feel forced to do. This is something that, that you just enjoy doing. I do, and I feel free when I do it. Well, wonderful. All right, Chloe, you still have a couple weeks left in the summer, so you're going to be heading back to your home, Atlanta. And what are you going to be doing besides painting this summer? I'm going to be hanging out with my friends. I'm going to be going to a summer camp. Mm -hmm. um, I'm also going to try to sign up for some other camps and other activities and sports. Well, good for you. Well, and I can't wait to see some more of your paintings. Are you going to be down to Key West anytime soon? Yes, probably next summer. Next summer. All right. So you're going to have to come back and talk with me, and you're going to have to bring some of your paintings so I can see them, okay? Yes. All right. So it's going to be landscapes, right? Landscapes and a animals that you're going to be painting? Or? Maybe even new things like people if All I right. can. I think that you'll be just fine at doing this. And of course, stop by Kate Studio. That is who Chloe has really been learning under. It's located on White Street the first Friday of every month from 5 to 9. You can come in and see some incredible work. Chloe, thank you again for being on. It's been a pleasure talking with you. I'm going to take a quick break right now, but I'll be right back after these messages.